This is an inference question and we have to find a statement that must be true on the basis of the statements in the argument. There is no conclusion in the argument and the missing link is not required. And our broad expectation from the correct answer choice is that it should be duly deducible from the information presented in the argument without any assumption or extrapolation. Answer choice A. The argument makes no suggestion regarding the candidates, competitors and their likelihood of success. So this answer choice which says that the competitors will succeed if a particular condition takes place, this answer choice cannot be established. So let's eliminate this answer choice. Answer choice B. The argument mentions that the candidate's goal is to meet demands for accountability. The argument also mentions that every improvement in accountability inspires a new round of demands for greater accountability. In other words, the argument indicates that if there is an increase in accountability, there will be more demand of accountability. So the candidate's goal will be met only if it is possible to increase accountability on a continuous basis, which is what is mentioned in this answer choice because it talks about the candidate's goal getting met only if it is possible to continue the current advances in accountability. So this answer choice can be inferred from the passage, a good answer choice. Let's keep this on hold. Answer choice C. This answer choice talks about a scenario in which a politician fails to accurately anticipate the demands of the constituents. In such a case, the politician may fall short of the demands of the constituents. However, in this scenario, no suggestion can be made about whether the politician will fail in advancing government accountability. So this answer choice cannot be inferred from the passage. Also, please note that the term certain to fail is extreme in nature and such answer choices are generally incorrect on the GMAT. So let's eliminate this answer choice. Answer choice D. This answer choice talks about a scenario in which a politician becomes satisfied with the accountability that the government displays. The argument mentions that if a politician is satisfied with the government's current level of accountability, that means this particular scenario is directly mentioned in the argument. In such a scenario, the politician will soon find out that the constituents are not satisfied. The passage makes no suggestion regarding the government accountability declining in such a scenario. So this answer choice cannot be inferred. So let's eliminate this answer choice. Answer choice E. The argument makes no suggestion regarding the current level of satisfaction of the candidate's constituents. So this answer choice which states that the candidate's constituents are currently satisfied. This answer choice cannot be inferred. So let's eliminate this answer choice. B is the correct answer choice.